Good morning and welcome to week four. Is it week four? I think it's week five. Week five of week five of lockdown. And in mind, follow me, let me waste your time. Set up I hope you are doing really, really well and staying safe. I thought this week I might, just might, vlog every day because I've not really been vlogging and I figured like actually I want to look back on what like lockdown life was like for us so I'm gonna see maybe what vlogging every day it is just before six o'clock Monday morning and like I say like week five so we're on like day 29 or something of lockdown and I'm going for a run I've got a bit of a headache this morning I don't really want to go I was just like I've been awake since like half past five I was lying in bed just like I really can't bother going running this morning but I know I'll like enjoy it once I'm out there and I'll be glad that I've done it I have got a bit of a injury to be honest my cough is a little bit sore I was doing the Joe Wicks PE the other day and I was getting a bit enthusiastic and my cough yeah kind of damaged it a little bit to be honest it's like a reoccurring injury I've had it before um so I've been icing it and stuff over the last few days and hopefully it will be okay i kind of just like just run slower and don't go too crazy i mean i'm a pretty slow runner anyway but i go even slower <laughs> than normal but yeah i'm gonna go and do this run about maybe a 3k 4k looks like it's gonna be a pretty nice day which is always good hear those birds singing a bit of a stretch to try and uh, help this car along the way Run finished. So glad I did it. I knew I would be. I tend to, in normal life, complain that I can't go for my runs. Obviously, when I've got children, I can't go because it's just me there. But now Lara's here all the time, I can go whenever. So I'm trying to remember that every time. Like I think, oh, I can't be bothered. I try and think. Normally, you wouldn't be able to go, so make the most of it. Oh, that was good. We had to wait in this morning for a little bit. We had um, a guy come round to sort out our boiler broke a while ago. And, well, it didn't break. We, someone came round to do the, the annual check and he said it was uh, knackered. So uh, we, needed, we needed a new one. So we got a new one fitted last Friday and then a guy, an electrician, came round this morning just to fit up the thermostat and all the, like, the controls for it. So we had to wait in this morning for that, which meant we couldn't do our, well I mean, I suppose we could have done Joe, but maybe it's a bit awkward to do like Joe's PA whilst this guy's walking around. So we haven't done that this morning. We'll probably try and do that this afternoon. But we're gonna go out on a walk because it's glorious outside. It looks really, I say it's glorious. It's probably got a bit of a chill, but it's like clear blue skies and it looks lovely. So I'm gonna go out on our daily exercise in a minute when Lara gets off a phone call. And it's back to school. Well, not back to school, school, back to, whatever this school is, is Stephen will have some uh, school work to do I'm sure I know that I've already like technically like been on my daily exercise for the day but I went at six o'clock it was I literally saw no one and obviously Laura can't go out and do her daily exercise by herself so we all go out for a walk all together and where we live I mean you hardly see anyone anyway to be quite honest it's really quite quiet when we go out on our walk so we're able to social distance and everything good morning <laughs> morning back to school have you had have you checked any work and stuff or yeah yeah have you got stuff yeah.
good. <laughs> I was just saying that to scare me. Did it scare you or not? No, not at all. <laughs> was it super bad? <laughs> Very steep. back from our walk that was really nice we've got like everyone's got bits of work and stuff Lara's working now Stephen are you doing school work Stephen's doing his school work what have you got a lot a lot <laughs> he's got a lot he's gone on his like class chart things this morning how many did you have nine 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 like nine different subjects of yeah, yeah. nine subjects of, it's all got to be done like uh, I think six hours today six really Six pieces of work <laughs> to do today. Um, so that was a bit of a shock when he looked up there this morning. Uh, I've just got a little bit of fostering paperwork to do, not really that much to be honest. I think we'll probably just sit here for like an hour or so, well, however long it takes to do our uh, schoolwork and paperwork and things. Look at that, pretty pleased with that. Step goal done at five past one. I just want to say a huge thank you to everyone who messaged me or left a comment on the last vlog. My, I'm grumpy, fed up, and I've ruined the day. I can't remember what it was called. Something like that vlog. <clears throat> if you haven't seen it, I'll link it down below and up there. Uh, basically, I was a grump. And like I said in that video, I wasn't going to post it. But then I thought it was, like, it was important to post it because... <coughs> <clears throat> excuse me um you know we all like it's difficult because i know that actually i've got it quite good compared to a lot of people you know who are struggling financially and you know have lost families and loved ones i've got it pretty good and so i think like who am i to be complaining about anything and it's not that i'm complaining but it's just actually this situation it gets us all down sometimes and i think it's important to say that and that that's okay that if you wake up and you're a bit of a grump and you're just feeling like crap for no reason other than like the whole situation it's like that's okay and we all are kind of going through that and i'm sure we all have days like that so yeah thank you to everyone who did send me a message and i know that you know everyone who's watching has those type of days and well maybe not everyone but i think most people are having those sort of days where they're just pissed off with everyone and everything and we're just short-tempered and it's to be expected and we've just got to get through this, you know, and we will one day at a time. You scared the life out of me. Um, blankets, they're down the side of where you're sitting, to the left, like behind the table there. I've uh, decamped into the garden because it's beautiful. Um, I'm just sitting right in a big shopping list for, um, for tomorrow. I'm going to go shopping tomorrow. We haven't been shopping for went on Friday like two weeks ago so like 16 days or so so I'm just sorting out a big like shopping list and kind of like a meal plan and everything everyone else is still working I've definitely got the uh, the better <laughs> end of the deal in terms of how much I've got to do I don't have that much to do realistically the little one um, has gone for a sleep and so that's why I'm sitting out here doing the meal plan they're having a little sleep upstairs Stephen He's not impressed, I don't think, with the amount of school work that he's, uh, that he's got today. He was supposed to be making tea tonight as well, but seeing as I've not done that much today, or not had that much to do, and he seems to have had like, a lot to do, we may swap something around so I cup tea rather than him. I know what I'm going to do. Rather than sit around, I hate sitting around doing nothing, I, I just can't do it at all. Um, and so what I'm going to do, oh, there's some pots in the garden that are just got like old crappy plants in and weeds and things, basically. Um, so I'm going to sort some of them out and then I can put in some of my, when they're a bit, bit grown, a bit bigger, the 
the seeds that I've planted like the tomatoes and uh, the lettuce and all the other little bits that I've planted I've done some courgettes as well what else did I do? Uh, beans I think can't quite remember but the things that I did I'm going to prepare the pots and get them ready because they're a complete mess because we had, well, we had our boiler fitted look I'll show you we came out here and like had to do some work and whatever up there and left all of this how are you getting on good you still got more work you know it's lovely outside do you want to come and sit out or are you pissed off you look really feed off <laughs> what's up just having work to do. Do you want to come and sit outside? Like the way you're in a jumper and I'm like <laughs> in like short, like a vest top and I'm yeah, boiling outside. Down. What? Like lying down. I know, I wish we had like a hammock or something in the garden, that would be nice. What work have you done? Computer sense. Computer sense. How much what else have you got? Science. English. To be done today? Yeah. That's a lot. What was I saying about Stephen and uh, making tea? He has just come and said to me, is there anything easier than mac and cheese? I was like, mac and cheese is so simple. Um, I think you are just a bit bummed out with yeah. like how long things have taken you and everything, aren't you really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Can't believe you're a jumper. So, he's good. I like, mac and cheese is really easy. Rather than like just leaving him and like following the recipe and stuff, I'm just going to like quickly go through with him so you need um butter milk and flour more importantly getting some chocolate is what he's doing so you wanna should we do it together yeah. we'll do it together we'll use um plump milk please bam, bam, bam. Yeah, so it needs to be It's the 20th today. Need to use So, you'd get your water on for your pasta, so that can be boiling. And then you need a smaller pan for your roux. So what you're going to do is add like a tablespoon of your butter. Mm. Tight is. Yeah. <laughs> a tablespoon of your butter. Let it melt. Yeah. A flour and you mix it together until it joins together into like a paste okay yeah. and then you slowly add your water uh, your milk and mix it mix it mix it so if you get some heat on this pan cooking time with Sarah and Steve Sarah and Steve oh, I always do it the yeah like yeah that'll do yeah, just no. plop it in. So your butter will burn in there if it gets too hot. So you want to make sure it doesn't burn. So you want to be mixing that up. Yeah. Stir it all around. That's disgusting. <laughs> it's disgusting. Mm, do probably yeah that's probably alright just mix 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 it's, it's you, you need like fast moving and yeah mix 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 you just keep doing that until until you mm, I'm not sure to be honest I, I'll I know when I see it okay. so you want that to kind of like combine all together so if you add it all at the same time It'll just be like a little mess, that's why you add it a little bit at a time. This isn't going to work. Oh, perfect. I want loads of it to take. Oh, do you want to be sick? <laughs> like, quick, I can't. Um, you can do it, it should be warm enough. Turn it right away from Pasta is always no problem with. And everyone in the whole world has a problem with how much pasta you should cook. 
that up. Do you want any herbs in the topping or? <laughs> Let's have some herbs. going to do all in one, well, go on. Wonderful. <laughs> How long does your macaroni take to cook? No How long does pasta take to cook? Uh, not long. How long is not long? Oh yeah, it's going in the oven, remember. Oh, yeah. Don't want to overcook it like I normally do. <laughs> you know what we've got to do now then? No. Leave it. Avengers, assemble. Don't tip all of it, just save a little bit back. Whoa! What's that layer on top? It's just like a, a skin. Into that? Yeah. And just mix it all together up. You can smell the it's thing. The, the, the herb. Yeah. Look at that, all ready, we're going in the oven. Looks delicious, are you pleased with that? Easy, wasn't it? Mm. That looks yum, I'm looking forward to having that in a little bit. Stephen's gone back to go and do a little more school work. He's just not impressed with the day, I don't think, at all. Um, but yeah, that looks pretty delicious for tea. I do think that it's very important that we teach our kids a little bit of basic cooking and that they have um, like some basic cooking knowledge and like you know how to cook maybe a few simple dishes so if Stephen can like leave home I'm not quite leaving home he's only 15 but if he can leave home having like you know he can make a mac and cheese and he can make a few different things I think that's pretty good and I think that's important to be quite honest delicious macaroni cheese I've scooped a bit out for the little for the little one but oh scoop it out save it off and we'll eat it in the garden I'm gonna, whoa, I don't know what's going on. I'm gonna end the vlog, but you know how people are doing really interesting, like useful things with their lockdown time? Do you know what I've learned? Well, I say learned. I'm on my way to learning. Check this out. Let me, uh, let me move. I'm learning the cup. Cup's on. Same for all, this is what I've got. I'm gonna mess it now, like I feel under pressure, I'm gonna mess this up, right, but. Problem. Do you know what I said? I watched this video. This, this one, it's crazy. We were watching, this was yesterday. Even, I was like, I want to know the cook's on. So we're watching this uh, like tutorial. So it's like, you do clap, clap, table, table, clap, up, down, clap, something, something, something. I don't know what that bit is. But that's how I learned it. Clap, clap, table, table, clap, up, down, clap. I'll mess that up. Well, so yeah, I'm going to spend my time productively during this uh, lockdown. But I'm going to go now. Thanks for watching today, and I will see you tomorrow because we're vlogging all week. See you tomorrow. Now, like, clap, clap, table, table, clap, up, down. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. This works. I'm gonna miss me when I'm gonna miss me when I don't. Hang on. Clap, clap, table, table, clap.
wrist, hand down, up, down, bang, and down, bang. And then I grab it. that. Yeah, then. So, uh, so let's find you. Here's your next cup. Okay, let's see if we can do it. Oh, 